Hey folks, we're back, part four. Uh, I just finished putting those shark eggs in. We've got the uh, dogfish fillets in the oil. They're starting to look really, really nice. Nice and golden brown. So while we're letting those sizzle away in the pan, I'm gonna go ahead and lay out my paper towels to absorb some of the oil once we take them out. Um, we've already got the dogfish liver that's been cooked. We're gonna uh, taste that real soon. We're gonna take everything out together. We're gonna see just how everything looks and how everything tastes. So you guys can see exactly what it's all about and how it's supposed to look and how it's supposed to taste. All right, so let's see how these eggs are looking. There's three eggs in here. We got two that are cooking a little faster than the other one. But they all look really well. They all look really good. You can check them to see how hard they are. Here's the first one that I'm gonna take out. I'm gonna put it right next to the liver. That's one. And you can always check, just like, they look just like egg yolks. And uh, they taste pretty close to chicken egg yolks. I mean, they're really, really good. Let me get something uh, separate to put them on so that we can take a good look at those by themselves. It's amazing. Before I actually caught them myself and filleted them, I'd never seen dogfish eggs. And it's just so amazing the similarities and the nutritional value is the same. Uh, it's more dense than a chicken egg, but it looks really, really similar. It looks really, really good. So you, you, the way that you check to see if they're done is you press on them to see how hard they are. And once they're solid, they're, they're done. So this one also is solid and it's done. There's your eggs. Those are your dogfish eggs. And those look really good. They look so close to regular eggs. And now we can take a look at our fish. Our fried fish fillets are looking really good. I'd say they're about a minute out. We're gonna give them about another minute. We'll flip them. But that's beautiful, folks. You can see how those look. Those look really nice. We're gonna take our paper towel and our plate and get ready to plate. And then also our fish fin soup. It's shark fin soup, they call it. Or we're gonna call it dog fin soup because they come from a dogfish, which is in this, the shark family. And we're gonna go ahead and bowl that soup. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. There's the shark fin. We take our scallions and we finish it off with some really nice green onions. And there's your shark fin soup. And we're gonna have a little taste test on that. And now, if you wanna come and see those fish fillets, you can go ahead and turn the fire off on those. I'm gonna take these out. And we're gonna plate them. Those look wonderful. Oh, they smell delicious too. I just like using a little paper towel to get that excess oil off of them. And here's your fish fillets. So, all together we have our dogfish liver, dogfish eggs, dog fin soup which is shark fin soup and our dogfish fillets and you can see that those fillets look absolutely gorgeous so here comes the real test now Let me clear a surface and we're going to cut into all of this to see just how it looks and how it tastes also so we're going to take dogfish liver first. That's almost like a potato chip. Look at that, folks. And so you want to get it really nice and crunchy and crispy on the outside. When you cut into it, that's what the inside looks like. 
it's just a little layer on the inside of that liver because like I said it's very rich and it's very uh, very soft uh, consistency so it's not for the faint of heart or light uh, lightly palated and so I'm gonna go ahead and taste a piece of this and I'll let you guys know what what I think that is delicious that is absolutely delicious there's no sliminess to it it's got a really nice uh, flavor it is a very a deep rich flavor it's really good, guys. I really like that. I can definitely eat um, that as an appetizer uh, to go into uh, anything that I'm eating. Would you like to try a piece? Uh, okay. Okay, I'll. I'll keep... I'm not the liver person. You know that. Yeah, I do. But you, but tell the truth. Wow. Oh, that's a surprise. That's good. Isn't that good? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't like liver. And here's someone that doesn't like liver, folks. And she. Oh um, my goodness. She doesn't tell a uh, non truth. So if she didn't like it, she would say she didn't like it. Oh, so now we're going to try one. Isn't that delicious? Yeah. And it's such, it's, it's such a wow. nice. And that's without a dip or without any sauce or anything. Oh my gosh. That is delicious. Shocked. Okay. So now we're going to try one of the eggs. Now, these eggs come from the dogfish. I want you guys to see what the inside looks like. That looks like the inside of a regular egg. Let me get the bottom sides up so you can see. Now, take a look at that, guys. That is what? <laughs> wow. That is amazing <laughs> that a, a, a dogfish, which is a shark, has eggs like that. That almost looks like a chicken egg, except for the shape. So now we're going to go ahead and try a piece. I'll try a piece first. Oh my gosh, that is very surprising. That is delicious. That is very, very delicious. Would you like to try a piece of the cut, egg? Yes, cut a smaller piece, please. <laughs> oh, she's um, a little wary of the egg. Yeah, I'm not an egg person either. I'll try that. I'll eat the other piece. That is delicious. Mm. And combined with the... Um, tastes like egg. <laughs> it does taste like egg. Yeah. But so far, I'm gathering that the liver is your favorite. The liver is delicious. Oh my goodness. That's really wonderful to hear, especially coming from somebody that doesn't like beef liver. I don't any like liver. any kind of liver. Could I have a little piece more of it? Of the liver? <laughs> yeah, just that little piece over there. That, there we go. We'll give egg. you a nice we'll give you a nice piece right here. Thank you. Not good, huh? Mm-hmm. Okay. And that was the lighter part of the liver. We still have the dark one to try. But we're gonna go ahead and take a, a taste of our shark fin soup. Now that's something that I know that you've never had. So I'm going to taste a little bit of this. And I'm going to get you a spoon and then I'm going to have you taste it. That is absolutely amazing. That is unlike any kind of a, uh, any kind of a fish stock that I've had. That's so rich and it's so flavorful. Oh my word, you've got to try this. You thought you liked the liver. Wait until you try this. Find you a nice spoon. And I know that you like scallions. Mm -hmm. So try that and be honest. Oh gosh, that's good. That's delicious. <laughs> that is so delicious. So there we are. So far, three for three. So let's go ahead and try this fish. And we both love fish. So we know what this is going to... Uh, more than likely tastes like so let's go and see uh, what it looks like as far as consistency is that nice piece of filet we'll cut into that and we'll see what the actual flake looks like that's what the flake looks like on the inside that is pure white meat that's just so perfectly beautiful white it's not mushy it's not wet or milky it's a nice dried filet and so I'm really anxious to see what this tastes like. Again. <laughs> that is absolutely delicious. Whenever you're cooking fish, guys, always remember that a piece of lime, a fresh piece of lime, or a fresh piece of lemon squeezed on the fish is actually, in fact, I'm gonna try this. That was, that's delicious. That is really delicious, but I think I have a lemon here, and lemon goes so well 
with fish. Then I'm gonna squeeze a piece of lemon on this and I want you to see what you think about this with some fresh lemon on it, sister. Why don't you try that? Oh, that's good. Oh, it reminds me of England. It fish does. and chips. That's the fish that we used to have in England when we lived in Great Britain. Oh. We've eaten fish and chips our whole young adult lives. And uh, that is that fish that we used to get with chips. Mm. That is delicious. That is absolutely delicious. I can eat that all day. Mm -hmm. Well, there you have it, folks. We've um, taken a dogfish. We filleted it. We've skinned it. We've portioned it out. We've taken the liver, uh, sliced it, seared it on both sides, taken out the eggs. We've cooked those. We've taken the fins off, made shark fin soup, and we fried the fillets. And every part of this dogfish is absolutely delicious. This is something that you guys um, might have heard that people say, oh, well, you can't really eat them. You know, they're a nurse shark, they're a dogfish, they're unedible. I'm here to tell you that it's absolutely uh, delicious and I give it a dual thumbs up and so does my sister as being completely palatable, every part of it. The dark one. You forgot the dark one. Oh, I did. Well, one. I didn't forget, but uh, I did. Uh, we can definitely see she's in love with this liver, folks. So I'm not <laughs> going to be able to get off of here without uh, at least tasting the dark one and showing you what it looks like. There's the dark one and what it looks like on the inside. Oh, and it's just as delicious as the light one. That's really good, folks. In mm. fact, the flavor on the dark one is a little milder as far as intensity than the light one. So there is a difference. The dark one you'd think would be, you know, more intense as far as the flavor, but the dark one, and I guess the color in the liver is depending on their diet or what they've last eaten or what they're consistently eating. But the light one had more of a liver flavor and I liked it. And it's not a beef liver flavor, it's just an intense liver flavor. And it's just so good for you. So I really enjoyed that. Well, there you have it, folks. Your dogfish is delicious. If you follow the recipes that I just did, you should have no trouble enjoying it. I'm definitely going to have some more of that shark fin soup. Thank you all for tuning in. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. That helps the channel. And I look forward to seeing you guys again soon. Bye for now.